Yo, what's up, everybody? How you doing? I hope you're having a great day. And it might get a little better, but it might get a lot better. And it's a little bit worse about today's news. Yesterday, um, that was like the 11th of August, there was no weekly update about Hogwarts Legacy. And Channel Wu tweeted out that there was going to be nothing today and we can expect something tomorrow. There was a little delay. So I kind of thought there was going to be like nothing big. It was just going to be um, maybe a change of plans and what they wanted to show or like something like that. But we actually got some really cool news and we finally have a release date for Hogwarts Legacy. And it's going to come out on February the 10th, 2023, which is a little sad because it's a delay, but I'm, I'm not that mad about it. It's going to come out on um, PlayStation, Xbox and PC. And the Switch version, um, they're gonna announce a little bit later, which is still, like it's still a little bit unclear if that's gonna be like a native version or a cloud version. I would guess a cloud version because I don't see how they would run this game natively on a Switch. It seems like a pretty, pretty hefty, intense game to play on the Switch. And I know I had some problems with uh, Zelda on the Switch and that's made for the Nintendo Wii U Switch, so, but yeah, they tweeted it out, and um, all the Warner Brothers Gaming Avalanche tweeted out a little video with Chandler Wood explaining they need some more time to, like, give the best experience to us, which, like, I don't know, it's a personal, like, it's a video which feels more personal, so uh, I kind of like that more. It gives me more confidence in that they are, like, really almost there, but just need a little more time which is like okay with me um i am usually not that bummed out well i'm bummed out about like delays but i can totally but i can totally see the, the like the other side if they need more time rather be like upfront with it than release a broken game like fallout or cyberpunk or something like that you know uh, i don't want another uh, one of those on my hands so yeah i think we can still um i don't know if we can expect like weekly updates um anymore i'm not sure because it's look if it's going to be 2022 it's like a shorter time period but if it's going to be 2023 or now i don't know if they're going to do weeklies but we still can expect like um a more in-depth info because like the, the 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 recent video that i did about the character creation that like we saw in the autodesk video um chandler wood said they're gonna go more in depth into it and they're also gonna show well they're probably gonna show something about like the last uh symbol the last tab that was there with the um hogwarts crest on it which i'm really curious about i wonder if they're gonna show that sooner than later i hope they will show something at like maybe an upcoming gaming event or like convention or that they even will do something like uh, nintendo like in hogwarts legacy direct in which they get us more hyped up, show us a little bit more about the game, what we can expect from it. But yeah, um, finally a release date, which is a concrete release date for so far. Um, let me know in the comment section down below, are you gonna pre-order and like, I'm kind of curious though, for what platform are you gonna pre-order it? Are you gonna play it on? Um, let me know. Here's like two other videos, probably this one is gonna be the Hogwarts Legacy Autodesk video. Watch it if you like and don't forget to subscribe like right about here and see you on the next video thanks for watching and bye bye